working with him. It's cool. He's, he's, he's like, he's like humble and, um, you know, like I, I learned a lot from him, you know, like, and, um, you know, like he, he always would tell me like, Hey, anytime you come on the set, go and you introduce yourself to everybody from the cater to the security guard, to the parking lot attendant, to, to the, all the grips, to the, you know, you're going to go and you're going to introduce yourself to everybody. You know, you can keep that, you can keep that shit humble. And respectful. I mean, I'm like that anyways, you know, but you know, I learned I, I learned that from watching him. We were doing rehearsal at, at one of Dave's house houses. So um I remember the first day that he showed up, he was working on Honey Boy. So he shows up to rehearsal. I'm not gonna say that I was like starstruck, but I was like, oh shit, that's the homie from the Transformers pulling up. And you know, he walked in and and he already, I guess he already knew about the script. So he he already knew what's up with me, and we just got right to it. You know, and, and, you know, there, there was a lot of situations with, with Shia. There was one where we were, um, we were rehearsing in Glendale at Shamrock Studios. It's like a stage, like stage. And then um, we're doing the scene and he's all up in my face. And we almost like, we almost, we almost went head up that day, you know? But, but the thing is that he was doing, he was just trying to like show me how to get that, that emotion out and then do the scene. So that's exactly what happened, you know? Got a, I got a lot of love for him, you know, and um, and he's he's like been showing a lot, of, like a lot of love back. Like you see him, he's always throwing up the H, you know, representing my my hometown, my neighborhood, you know. Tatted the H on his stomach. Every picture you see him, and he's throwing up that H. As a matter of fact, you know. So you know he, he's family, you know. So like, 